This is the first solo trip for 2023. <laughs> 2023 is gonna be an amazing year for all of us. So, cheers, girl. So, hey guys, welcome to a new vlog. Starting this vlog in a taxi because I'm on my way to the airport. Hey guys, I mean, you already seen by the title. I was going to see like, can you guess where I'm going to? But it just looks dark. But by the title, you already know where I'm going to. We are going on a solo trip to Brussels. This is my first solo trip for 2023. And I am super excited. It takes me about like 30 minutes or more to get to the airport. And I also wanted to um, do my makeup and my hair and everything because I might do something immediately I get to Brussels so this is not like this is not normally the outfit that I would wear if I'm going to the airport this is not an airport fit like I look way too much for the airport usually I always look homeless whenever I'm traveling but for this since it's like a getaway like a short trip I kind of already have like all the days plans so I think just depending on how everything goes like the flights you know getting from the airport to my hotel and everything depending on how it goes I also want to go out today so I also want to do some stuff today so hopefully everything just goes really well but yeah um, Wish me well, wish me luck. I'm so excited. I've never been to Belgium before, so this is obviously like officially my first time going to Belgium. So I'm also not really a big travel vlogger because you guys know I really haven't vlogged my trips and I travel quite a bit, I would say. But yeah, um, I'm excited. I know I'll make it because I'm not checking any bag. And also, oh my god, you guys, I parked really really light and which is so unlike me because i don't know how to park light i don't even know how to park like point blank period i don't know how to park i parked really light like i don't have a check-in luggage well i think i did it one time last year i was so sure when i did that last year that i wasn't going anywhere it was for a quick trip also so this one i'm pretty sure i do have activities so having to like park with just a checking sorry with a hand luggage why do i keep saying checking is quite it's a lot okay so anyway i'm going to have to live on that this entire trip so i hope i'm able to survive on it i don't have a lot of things to be honest for instance with my wig all i have is a comb and then the tools like the hot iron and stuff but i don't have like the spray and everything because i couldn't find it in a smaller size i'm hoping to get um something when i get to brussels and stuff now i'm talking sweet all by myself put your arms around me put your faith in me put your love on me i just passed security and i don't know if i should get a bottle of drink or wait till i get to the hotel Usually when I'm traveling, I get a bottle from the airport. One is cheaper, two saves me the hassle, and actually options also. So I don't know if I should just get, I was thinking of getting Bailey's, but I definitely don't want the big bottle. It's just me and it's the weekend. Again, I'm thinking of champagne. I think I'm going to get champagne instead because champagne just kind of makes more sense to me than had liquor. I think I want to get champagne. I mean, it is the first solo trip of the year, so I'd like to pop, I'd like to pop like a bottle when I get to the hotel. So maybe I should just get this one. Maybe I just get like a bottle of Prosecco or something. Yeah, maybe, maybe this. Because, I don't know, it makes more sense to me. Sorry. Or maybe clip pot. I think I'm going to get the, just a bottle of clip pot. Probably. Yeah, maybe this. Oh no. Wait. Well, pretty much not a difference. I'm gonna get a bottle of Prosecco instead. Are you guys like, you know how, I don't know if 
you guys heard me in my previous vlog and I was just like I don't mind like I'm not shy vlog vlogging in public but the airport is so packed so that's kind of giving me anxiety but we move I have to get content for you guys so I, I have to overcome it anyway can I it's closed okay all right thank you I should or maybe I should have gotten wine but no champagne is champagne makes more sense so I decided to stop at this um, Japanese place. I think it's called. That's what it's. It's a Japanese place, right? Yeah. I'm going to quickly eat this because. Hmm, this tastes really good. Like really, really good. I don't want to have nothing in my stomach because I'm going to be really tired. But it tastes really, really good. Jesus. What's the name of this place? It tastes like Nigerian fried rice. It tastes really, really good. Oh my God. I can't stop saying that because it actually tastes so good. It's good. So we would like to remind you that all the passenger travel with the priority boarding uh, and with the like full ticket ago, that you can put only the suitcase here, I guess like the overhead locker and all bags you can be packed once you saw the need to sit in front of you. Let's if you travel instead with no priority boarding, like that means with the white ticket you must put all your belongings under the seat in front of you at the exception of row. Okay, thank God. Because I was waiting, but anyway, like like I told you guys, we bought it like a few minutes ago. A lot of people are still coming in. To, like, I would like uh, stuff. to inform you that changing seat is not allowed. You must remain seated at your seat okay. as you know, located for weight and balance reason before they come. Thank you, and the judge will try. Okay, finally. But anyway, I'm a little bit tired. Actually, I wouldn't say I'm tired. I'll say I am. Um, I just want to lay down. <laughs> I just I, I just really want to lay down. I don't want to sleep or anything. I'm not tired, tired. I just want to relax. Do you get what I mean? So I can't wait for us to get to Brussels. So another thing there is I know that it's about another hour drive from the airport. So I keep trying to not look at the driver. That's the reason why I like you see my eyes moving like that's why. I know it's another hour drive from the airport to the hotel. I'm not looking forward to that because it's a car ride. But anyway, um, yeah, I'm just waiting. I can't wait to just check into the hotel. You know that feeling? That first feeling you get when you like get into a hotel? Yeah, I want that feeling right now. We literally just landed. Well, not just landed, but I just got to the airport, like um, Brussels. Oh my god, one of one of my ear is still blocked. Okay, so I have to figure out how to get a taxi. I'm going to use the bathroom then I'm going to come back and figure out how I'm going to get out here because they don't have bolts. We are in my hotel! I am super excited but before I like offload and figure out you know what I'm going to do next and like you know, tell you guys how it has been up until this point, let me just quickly give you guys a room tour. By the way, since this video is going to go up when I'm back to Budapest, I don't mind sharing my location. So I am going to be staying at the Hilton, but it's the Double Tree by Hilton or something like that. So I'm going to be staying here for the time that I'm going to be here, obviously. Again, I'm not going to be here, so that's the only reason why I'm sharing my location because if you're going to be uploading videos in real time and you're in that location, I feel like it's not smart to do so. So I'm going to quickly give you guys like a room tour. This is the door when you come into the room. When you come in, this is pretty much, you know, what you see. My bag is here just because I wanted to give you guys this tour. Then to your left, you have the bathroom and the toilet it's actually really nice as expected as the pictures really nice and then it has like a wardrobe i think it's a i should actually open it because i'm always paranoid when i go to hotels i just want to make sure there's nothing in the hotel anyway has this little mini coffee area 
I think this is going to be a fridge here yeah, with, with a safe. Yep. Then we have the room, TV, little area. This is the bed. It's quite spacious. I love that it has this mirror. I really love that it has that. So I don't have to like struggle in the bathroom to, you know, get my outfits together. But yeah, it's actually really cute. I didn't go for anything like extra because obviously I'm alone. And also I want to be outside most of the time. I was supposed to go to the Museum of Fine Arts, but obviously that is closed. It closed at five, so I can't make that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to the Royal Gallery of no the Royal Gallery of Saint Hubert. That's what it's called. It's really pretty. Also the shopping center or something like that. So anyway, I'm gonna go there because I actually do need to go into some stores to see what I could get for my hair. <laughs> so I have to go out into the city and I'm also going to try the Delirium Cafe, which is obviously Belgian beer. Why would you come to Brussels? Why would you come to Belgium without trying their beer or their waffles or their chocolate? I'm going to kind of freshen up a little bit. I'm going to be really, 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 really quick. And also, oh my God, I, when I was in taxi coming, by the way, the taxi was so expensive. I don't even want to talk about it. I'm just so happy that I'm here. But that amount that I paid for that taxi was ridiculous. I, I'm even ashamed to say it because I didn't plan. Like, that was one part that I didn't plan at all. And I paid so much. Jesus. But yeah, um, I don't think I brought my camera charger. Like... I'm just praying to God I actually did bring it because I don't remember putting it in my bag. I actually don't remember. I can see my phone charger, but I don't see my camera charger, which is so sad. You always have to make sure that your phone is charged because obviously you're alone. If I go out and I see something that could work, I'm going to ask them at the reception also just to, to, to see if they have something that could work for me because it will only make sense to use my camera like camera quality is the best right but yeah let me just reserve this battery camera till i figure out or maybe it's in my no it's, it cannot be in my box it cannot in my bo be in my box no because if i took my phone charger i could have grabbed the charger because they were pretty much in like in the same socket <laughs> Maybe when I go out. I have just two bars left on my camera, so I need to go out. But I wanted to pop the champagne because this is not the right way to open it. <laughs> I know this is the ghetto way to open it. So anyone who is watching this, please don't come for me. This is not the right way, I know. And by the way, I just touched up my makeup a little bit, like changed my top. And during this trip, you guys are going to see a lot of this leggings because I brought three. Three, this is the H&M leggings in my last vlog that I told you guys that I'm obsessed with. Listen, I, I literally wear this thing all the time because it's thick, it's so comfortable, and with the cold weather, like, it attacks it very well. And it snatches me out. You all see? I love it. So I brought three of this for this trip, and I'm going to be just be changing different tops and outerwear and stuff, but it's going to be this leggings, like this leggings all through the strip but i wanted to pop the champagne and have just a glass before i step out because like i said this is the first solo trip for 2023 so oh my god i don't want this to pour over my my bed because it's going to i don't i hate popping champagne i actually do because i always feel like the stuff is going to hit me in my eye but yeah um I want to pop it because it's what the first solo trip for 2023 and we're beginning the year strong Ooh! <laughs> oh my god I'm so scared of popping champagne but yeah um, I asked them to give me a glass and also a champagne bucket while I was charging my phone and you know touching up my makeup and my hair I was also playing music earlier until my friend called me, Fatim called me, so we're on the phone for a bit before she just got off now. I, I don't know how to preserve this thing though. 
I'll just leave it here. But yeah, cheers to wait. <laughs> wait, are you just kidding? Cheers to an amazing, amazing 2023. More trips, more money, more sense, more wisdom, more brain, more everything. You know, like 2023 is gonna be an amazing year for all of us. So cheers girl cheers okay i'm not going to drink too much because obviously i'm going out i need my eyes to be open when you're traveling alone your eyes always have to be open okay huh. the hotel is actually so pretty i'm already thinking of where I could take pictures because I'm definitely gonna take pictures tonight. So I'm not going to stay out like so late because I really want pictures, okay? I want a lot of pictures. So I'm going to try my best to utilize the hotel. But now like she told me that there is this, there's a mall right across the hotel. Yeah, that's the mall right there. Like right here, that's the mall there. She said the name of the electronic store is called Finac. So, ah, oh, ooh, that was a, that was a lot. Next stop from here will be the gallery of, of what again? The Royal Gallery of, wait, the Royal Gallery of Saint Hubert. Yes, we're going to go there, spend like a few minutes, then. Tell me they're closed. Oh, they're not it's open. It's like Media Mart. If you know Media Mart. But yeah. I got the goods. I'm just about to pay for it. It's a little, a pretty buck, but I gotta do what I gotta do for you guys because if I don't buy this, I won't be able to vlog because I can't make videos with my phone. Hi. Good evening. Can yes. I have a small bag as well? Ah, small bag. It's this. And my turn. It's five cents. Sure. Okay. Card, please. Card? Yes. Thank you. Voila. I'm going to use my Revolut. And then the ticket. Sure. Thank you. Thank you so much. Yeah. Good evening. Bye. I got ev I got a lot of stuff. I'm gonna talk about them when I get back to the hotel. But I just got to the Royal Gallery, so I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like. The bar streets, we have something similar. Um, in Budapest. So I'm gonna go to the end and then pick one that I want to sit in. So I'm going to just look through anyone that I like. I'll just sit. From the house that's a strong plant and you have flourish peach and cactus that's very sweet and a lot of fruits and actually the cactus is green and you can choose between 25 and 50. Okay so which one is? This one is the most uh, common one. Yeah the common, the, not the common, this one is the common but uh, this one is the best seller from the house. But it's not green, sorry it's not it's No not the red. peach is the, is, no no red. It's regular. The regular. But if you're looking for red beer, I have cast No no no, red. I want the peach one. Peach one? 25 yeah. or 50? 25. 25 or something small. So we're here to try the beer. Let's go. <laughs> oh, I feel like this is too close. Okay, okay I think that's good. I'm about to try the beer. Girl, I see your face everywhere. When I'm going out, you'll be there. 
Cause everything reminds me of you I can't take no more Girl, I think I'm losing my mind Try to go to work, but I lost track of time Cause everyone keep looking like you I can't take no more From your hands and your body Hi, I just got back to the hotel I'm trying to look for somewhere I can place you guys so that I do what I have to do right now Wait, is this okay? No, I think this is too low Today was actually really productive I got everything that I wanted to get Also, oh my god you guys Ah, uh, how haven't I told you guys this? So I went to the mall. You guys know that I went to get the charger for my lap for my camera, and then I got it. You guys saw that, and then I walked past this beautiful girl, and because I was going to look for a shop, because I like I told you guys I didn't get my got to be spray or anything, so I don't know. You know, I I was trying to find something to, you know do my hair tomorrow when I'm going out and stuff. Then I walked past this girl at first because I was trying to go into a store that was that they were sitting next to. So I entered into the store. I thought I was going to find the got to be there. I didn't find the got to be. So when I came outside, I went to the girl and I was like, um, hi. And then the first thing she asked me was, are you a YouTuber? And I'm like, I froze, you guys. I froze. And then she proceeds, and I saw, I told her yes. And then she proceeds to tell me that she literally just watched my video like a few hours before she got to the mall. And she's so surprised to see me in the mall. You guys, I froze. Because it's one thing for people to recognize you in your city. That's pretty much a given to get. But for you to go to a whole different country, not city, a whole different country, and then someone recognizes you. Honestly, I. I couldn't even like you guys I was going to pull out my camera and like you know shout them out and talk to them and stuff so you guys could see but like I was frozen like I just kept thinking about it I'm like nah it's wild you guys it's wild but anyway she was so sweet so I told her I was looking for got to be I told her I just came obviously because she was like I can't believe I'm seeing you and I'm like yeah because I just came and all that and then she and her friend they took me to this shop I would have gotten all of this on camera but you guys I was in so much shock I couldn't get it on <laughs> but they took me to the African like it was like an African it, it was an African shop and I bought a bunch of things from that so shout out to you girl like thank you so much like you literally made my trip already by telling me what you told me <laughs> but anyway i had a good time out i went to the gallery as you guys saw and i also went to have belgian beer which is so cool i was thinking to get like room service but i saw that they had kfc outside the hotel and the KFC looked bougie. <laughs> it looked so bougie. And I was like, I have to try it. Because every time I go to a new country and I see that their KFC is pretty much different from the KFC that we have in Budapest that literally looks raggedy and ratchet, I always want to try to see how it tastes. So I just got like two piece chicken meal and stuff. If it's not good, then I'll just go ahead and order room service. But I'm hoping that it'd be good. I don't really want to eat too much, even, if, even though I'm hungry. But yeah, I'm a bit tired. I think I'm going to retire for the night. But it was really fun already. Day one is already fun. I just hope and pray that the trip continues like this because I already love the trip so far. But I just want to quickly show you guys the things that I got from the African store the girls took me to. I got got to be... I need it I need this so bad and also Fatim needs one as well so she asked me to get one I picked up the edge booster because I need some type of wax stick I got edge brush because I didn't bring I don't know what was wrong with me I got um what are these called <laughs> my brain is already dying <laughs> but I actually got um wig caps then oh my god you guys if your african specifically nigerian you remember this this is imperial leather the soap oh my god i saw this in the store and i have not i had not i've not seen this in years 
So when I saw it, I'm like, oh, I really, really, I'm going to use this because I remember how it smells, but it would be so refreshing to smell that again. So I'm going to use it to take my shower right now because I'm going to, I got this Ebon um, lace glue. I got some pencils. I got these, like, I got these lip gloss. If you're Nigerian or African, you know these. <laughs> I found this um, lace dissolvent remover thing. I love it. Mine was already finished and I didn't want to order it from Amazon. I'm glad I saw it in the shop. Um, I got Toffee. I saw the Elegal Concealers and I got Toffee. I got one for myself and I got for Fatim as well. Before I take a shower, I'm going to have, wait, my battery's almost dying. I'm going to have a piece of this chicken. I'm going to have a bite from the chicken just to let you guys know if it's good or not because I know definitely when I don't take in my shower, I'm not going to turn on this camera again. I think it's, it's normal. It's no difference. Good morning. From Brussels. <laughs> well, I lied. I already opened my eyes and went through my phone. Well, I need to stand up. You know, freshen up and all that stuff. This is officially our first full day in Brussels. So we have to make the most out of it. So we have a couple stops today. But first thing, we need to get food because last night after I tried the, what's the word? The chicken from KFC. I was supposed to order room service because honestly, it wasn't feeling. It was all right. It was just regular. I'm not going to eat it again right away. But I should have ordered room service, but I was so then I was on the phone with my friends. Then I slept. And I just woke up. So I need to get food first. That's like the first thing. I need to eat breakfast. Because I'm actually hungry. And I need to drink water. Like I need to chug a bottle of water. Because yesterday I didn't. Ah. I didn't drink enough water yesterday, so I feel terrible today. So I need to chug like a whole bottle. I have the bottle, but that's what's that's what's holding the camera right now. So um how do I do this? Okay, yeah. It worked. Oh my god! I ordered sparkling water. Uh, mm. <sighs> Ooh. I hate sparkling water. Does it say rain? It is raining! I don't know why I didn't check the weather, but it's raining. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh, what's that? It's not that bad though. I'm going to take out my wig, reinstall it because this looks a mess. Reinstall it, do my makeup. I get dressed I just I took a shower then I also did my hair you guys this took me like an hour to do because that's why the fact that I went to get the got to be and everything I still didn't have a lot of things my hair is a mess like I'm slightly annoyed because my hair is going to be looking like a mess this entire trip but it's a short trip so I'm not even tripping I am so hungry like I told you guys and I got Room service! 
that was so unnecessary but i'm gonna show you guys what they got me they got me breakfast super cute i asked for tea though oh yeah okay super cute wait i need to move so youtube can see my towel so they don't flag the video as nude but yeah i'm really really hungry i've not checked the weather like through the window to know if it's actually raining it's still raining we are ready to go okay i didn't vlog myself getting ready because i filmed that as a separate video so stay tuned for that video i filmed the makeup i filmed the outfit everything so i'm not going to talk about that in this vlog so you just have to watch the video but we're ready to leave i'm going to be carrying this um, backpack as well because i have my tripod in here and i have some shots in mind that i'd like to take today so hopefully everything goes well i'm able to take the shots and everything oh i didn't spray perfume oh. i did use my perfume oil but i didn't spray perfume so for perfume let me drop you guys so that i can do that wait is this good no that's not good let me drop it here okay let's quickly do this for perfume i actually brought a couple perfumes but i brought black opium i know i know i have a love-hate relationship with black opium i've had this relationship with black opium op opium for years but there's just something about the coffee in here that I just gravitates that i gravitate towards like all the time whenever i smell it they were having a promotion during the christmas sale and i picked it up i love it honestly i do sometimes i don't but most times i do just take it like that and then i have this perfume from Rasayo Oud. That's the oil I use initially. Let me just quickly show you guys. I need to go, but let me show you guys. Okay, so it comes with the perfume oil, which I already used on my skin earlier. earlier. And I'm going to spray this. This is going to be my scent for today. Because the weather is quite cozy and like cool. So I want something that's also like cool, but woody and spicy. So also i got these um i've forgotten what they're called is it decant decant i've forgotten what these things are called i actually forgot what these things are called but they are small small perfume vials that you could put like perfumes in like you could put your own perfumes in so i put one perfume from rasaya oud and i also put another perfume from um what's the name of the brand Penhaligon's uh, Legacy of Petra. So today I'm feeling Penhaligon's Pe Legacy of Petra because it goes well with Hanin, in my opinion. So I'm going to also spray that. So I'm in a taxi. I'm on my way to my first stop. It was supposed to be the mini Euro, but unfortunately it's closed now. And you know what's crazy about this? What's even pissing me off right now is the fact that I actually did my research. I did my research and then I checked and it was open the day that I even checked it. It was open the day I put it on my list. It was open. And right now they said they are not open until March. March, April. But it's okay. So I'm going to the Atonium and that'll be my first stop. I hope I'm able. It is not raining right now but at the reception when i was leaving the hotel they told me that it would rain again like later so they gave me an umbrella so i'm carrying much more than i intended to which is <sighs> very frustrating but solo trips are usually like that because if you want to get pictures you have to take pictures by yourself right so you have to like take <laughs> you have to take a lot of stuff everywhere because if you're carrying a tripod if you're carrying a camera which i am carrying so i want pictures i have to make do with what i can find but i feel like because the weather is not great there wouldn't be a lot of people there so at least that is good for me because that way i wouldn't like i would have free time to take my pictures i mean hoping that would be the case but I don't think so. The weather is not great for people to be out. A lot of people are out on the streets. So, yeah. I took bolts, by the way. 
So, and the reason why I'm mentioning that is because from where the airport is, Bolt or Uber don't work there. So it only works like obviously in the main city, like in Brussels. Like, and listen, I don't even know how to explain this. But anyway, I'm gonna make do with what I can for today. I hope I have a good time as I did last night because last night was lit. Like. I had a really good night last night. Like I really, really, and my makeup is sitting. Okay, it is sitting. You guys, I just got to the Atonium, and yes, my umbrella is open because it's raining and it's so windy. It's not like I don't think the rain is that bad. I think the wind is just terrible, and it's you know when wind and rain mix together, it's just a mess. But yeah, I'm at the Atonium, and again, these shoes. You see these ones? Oh, not the right shoes I should have worn. Cause I wanted to wear my regular black boots, but that's not the way I planned the outfit. Well, actually, that's how I planned the outfit. But anyway, um, <sighs> what a day. <laughs> but you know what's funny? Initially, when I was in the taxi, my mood was about to go down because I was going down because I was just like, yeah, the weather is not good, all that kind of stuff. But when the rain hit me when i got out the taxi which is weird i actually feel good i feel good i love that i'm here but i want a picture of the atonium though but i have to step back i don't know how to do that <sighs> i don't know how to do that wait i'm going to have to look for a way to i want a really clear picture i wanted myself in front of the atonium but that's not going to happen so because of how crazy the weather is and <laughs> this is further validating the point of me going to Bruges tomorrow because well I don't know if I told you guys but I want to go to Bruges which is a different city in Belgium I didn't think I would do it but now with the way the weather is and the fact that mini Europe isn't open and all that I really don't have much to do well, there's really not a lot of things to do right now so i'll probably go to bruce tomorrow but let me just make do with what i have today first let me find a way to take a picture and yes my tripod all of it is becoming useless but wait let me try i am in line to get a ticket to go into the atonium not just <laughs> the line was long a few so. oh hi I want one ticket for an adult. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry? Hungary. Hungary. Okay, a uh, card? I don't know why she asked where I was from anyway. Because I just feel like that was all necessary. Oof. Cut down. We're going on you guys. I scanned my ticket and we're going inside. Ooh, so exciting. This is so nice. Absolutely so pretty. I can already tell that I'm going to really be screaming. Not screaming, but I feel like I'm going to be saying wow a lot. I don't want to be shy, use the stairs a lot though. I don't. I mean, these are cute. I don't think I'm going to waste time here. <laughs> because guys, I am trying. I am not really like the touristy type of person. But I am trying. You know, whenever I travel, I just try to explore the city the way that I like to explore. But not necessarily look at so many things. But for this one, I'm trying. I really want to see stuff. This is the white part. Do you guys see how cute this is? Oh, now we're getting to the light part. Okay, let me take a video on my phone as well. <laughs> Vlogging and making videos is quite hard, but this is cool. So we're going to take the stairs. The stairs, whatever I say. We're taking the stairs. Why is the light going off? That's creepy. 
girl, I see your face everywhere When I'm going out, you'll be there Cause everything reminds me of you I can't take no more Girl, I think I'm losing my mind Try to go to work, but I lost track of time Cause everyone keep looking like you I can't take no more I miss your touch From your hands and your body It hurts so much To think of you as someone else when you're sweet talking to me Waiting in line to get into the elevator I think we're going to be like a bunch of us is One, two, three, four, five Yeah, I think all of us are going to get in the next round So the elevator kind of just takes you up And then brings you down I guess Something like that So that will be the last part for the Atonium before I finally leave I think we're going in Okay, so we're at the top and I really, but these windows, because it's um, wet, you can't really see, but that's mini you up there, but I wish it wasn't closed. I smell food. I think I'm, I'm too hungry to be here actually. The reason why I was smelling food is because it's a restaurant here. It smells good, but I don't think I want to go there. I think I'm actually done, <laughs> to be honest. I think I am. Um... I would have maybe loved to take a picture here. Maybe I should try and see if I can take a picture here. I just got to the Grand Palace. I'm a bit tired and hungry, but I just want to pick up chocolate for my colleagues. So I think I'm just going to go with this. It's cute. And I also need to pick up for Benny as well. So this is the grand place. It's really pretty. I don't know if you guys can see the, the detailing of the beauty. They are so nice, like they're actually gold, like really pretty. It's such a, a shame that I came when the weather is so bad, but it looks so pretty. Can I see? So nice. We are about to have a Belgian waffle. I just placed my other anyway. I got the waffle with dark chocolate and pistachio this is what it looks like oh, i came inside in the shop mm -hmm. to sit so i can try the waffle It's so good. It's so good. <laughs> I literally just got inside the house. The house, right? I literally just got inside of my hotel room. I am so tired. Today was a lot, but it was so fun. Well. It was fun for me though, not gonna lie. I was going to, I was going to say rubbish, but it was actually fun. Like I liked it. I'm back home. I was going to go to the, I'm back, what did I just say I'm back home? Oh, I was going to go to the Royal, the Museum of Fine Arts because I was going to go there yesterday. If you guys remember, I was supposed to go there yesterday, but they closed at five. And I couldn't make it so I thought I was gonna go there today I could actually still go there but to be honest with you guys I am too tired I'm hungry I want to have dinner like a really cute dinner 
To be honest, I don't even know because I told you guys I wanted to go to Bruges. But I told you guys I wanted to go to Bruges tomorrow. I still don't know if I will go. I want to relax as much as I can. So I don't know if I'm going to take tomorrow as that relaxation day. I'll ask them in the hotel if they have like spa or all this kind of stuff. If they do, then I might do that instead because I really don't want to suffer tomorrow. Okay? I mean, I love to travel, but I don't like stuff. I hate stuff of trip. I just had. Oh, the light here is. God damn! That's so good! But I touched up my makeup, wore this dress. Uh, let me show you guys what, how the dress looks. It's a simple dress. This is how it looks. I went to have dinner. I'm gonna be having dinner downstairs. But what I was about to tell you guys earlier, <laughs> I had to go downstairs to take pictures and obviously by myself. So I couldn't bring my camera with me. Like I couldn't bring this camera because it'll be too much for me to carry downstairs. So I used this with my phone. I first of all used my, well, I first tried my camera, like my big camera. It wasn't working. I don't think I'm going to take this. I'm going to take this when I'm going downstairs later for drinks. But I already got cute pictures. Like, really cute pictures. So follow me on Instagram if you're not following me. Girl, these pictures are good. Oh, my God. But anyway, it got me so excited. I went down. I took good pictures. So let's go and have dinner. I feel like I'm going to really stuff myself this evening because, girl, I haven't had anything to eat today. So... Except for the waffles. So, let's go and eat. Let's get eat some food. So, it's gonna be cool. I'm so excited because when I started shooting, I started shooting here, like in this place, but it wasn't given. But now that I, I now, I can't even speak. Am I in the right place? Yeah. Now I feel like it's because I was using my camera. I should have just used my phone because my phone takes bomb pictures. Oh. Our glass of wine. I got a. This is not a uh, Chardonnay. I think I got a Sauvignon Blanc. That's what I got. And I already ordered. I forgot to. I forgot to vlog that, but I ordered, I think I ordered beef tenderloin with, I don't even know the size, I can't remember the size, but I hope it's good. But yeah, I'm just going to eat, chill, and then I'll go upstairs, chill for a while, while I feel like here would like kind of calm down, because I didn't expect it to be a lot of I didn't expect it to be a lot of people. I thought it was going to be like only just a few people so I could take more pictures. But I'm going, well after dinner, I'm going to go upstairs, just chill for a bit. And come back later. Just to have like a couple drinks. My food is here. I just hope this is good, to be honest. It looks good. I just hope it tastes good. Your girl is back. I'm back in the room. And I'm a bit tipsy. <laughs> I'm a bit tipsy, but I did have a really good dinner. The food was just there. Honestly, I'm not even going to lie and say it was great. It was just there. It was... The whole thing spectacular. I've had, like, way, way better steak you know what's crazy i feel like i'm not even full because that food was really small it's not it's not just because it was small honestly i just i don't think it, it was it's because it was small i don't know i feel like i need to eat something i want to eat pasta so but i didn't want to stay upstairs anymore and i don't think i'm going to go downstairs you know how i was telling you guys earlier that I will, um, what's the word? I'll come back up, then go back down. <sighs> That's not gonna happen. Y'all see my eyes? Y'all see my eyes? 
Do you all see my eyes? <laughs> and that's because I've been drinking. And honestly, the bar is actually full. I didn't expect it to be that full because obviously like it's a hotel and it's their bar and usually their hotels are really, like hotels aren't really packed, did you get? But this one is packed. <laughs> it's packed and people keep coming in. And that's not the vibe I'm going for. If not out, I've actually gone out out because there are like some other bars and restaurants that I had in my list that I would have tried. But I'm not in the mood to be around like a lot of people. I'm just in the mood to like do specific things. Maybe in our next solo trip, we'll go clubbing and stuff, but and go to a lounge or a bar or something like I would normally do. But for this one, girl. <laughs> I don't want to be around a lot of people and it just seems like a lot of people downstairs i feel like tomorrow will be better so tomorrow will be a better time to actually go to the bar and i'm excited to take more pictures because girl this picture is a fire the one i took today anyway but yeah i'll order a pasta 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 i just smelled my hand and i remembered that i actually bought a perfume but i didn't take you guys into that show because it was when i was leaving um uh, what's the word when i was leaving the grand place i saw this perfume store and i and i went into it but i had too many things in my hand and obviously you guys knew no blah, blah, blah. what you guys know that it was raining so i couldn't go into like i just couldn't vlog while i was in the perfume shop and i spent like a good minute there i'm gonna go back to that shop tomorrow if they are open <laughs> i'm gonna get a big bottle of the perfume that i got because this thing wait where is it so i got these ones it's the uh, wise plum and i got it in 10 ml like two 10 ml because it only had like 10 ml and 50 ml and it's not really that cheap but at the, at the same time it's not really expensive it's about 20 euros or something like that but anyway I'm going back to get the big bottle because this thing smells good. Like if we, if they're not open tomorrow, before I leave on Monday, I must get the big bottle because I don't think it is a. Um, I'm trying to because the lady gave me her card, so I'm trying to see if they are open tomorrow. I'll check it later. But the perfume, girl. Oh, Jesus. I'm happy because my food just came. I always... This is entertainment news. Why is this so loud? Let me get the remote. Okay. Pasta with clamps. And they're also going to bring water and two glasses of Chardonnay. Good morning, beautiful people. Obviously, it's the next day. It's our last full day in Belgium. I am ready. I didn't want to like waste time because I woke up at past eight today, and I just wanted to, you know, get dressed and everything. I decided to go to Bruges. You know, last night I was talking a lot of mess. I was like, oh, I don't think I would because of the weather, but it's not raining today, so I decided to make do with the day. You know, just kind of go to Bruges like I wanted to. I have my back backpack set. Oh, let me show you guys my outfit. My outfit for today is this jacket I wore. The first day, it's a Zara jacket. I have this always. I wear this every day, ever, anyway, ever since I got here. So I've been wearing this inside my jacket or my coat. And then I have this top, really cute, uh, basic and obviously I told you guys I brought like three of these leggings and then I have my new balance shoes regular this color of shoes actually is not ideal like it's not my regular color let me show you guys it's not my regular color but I wanted something different so that's why I got this but yeah this is what I have for it I already packed my camera my tripod and my back pack and I'm also going to carry this purse. Uh, I was having some tea earlier. I'm going to carry this and then we are off. 
let's go and explore Bruges. So I just got into the train and I am on my way to Bruges. Hopefully I'm in the right train to be honest because honestly I just winked it. And I walked from the hotel to the train station was like about five minutes although it took me longer than that because I just couldn't understand Google Maps, right? It was just messing up. And oh, that's one thing I've noticed in Belgium. It's like, it just messes up. Like, it just takes you around and around. And that's okay. I picked up breakfast. Um, I picked up waffles, obviously. When you're in Belgium, you just have to stuff yourself with waffles and fries. And then go to the gym base, basically. But anyway, I need to arrange my hair because... <laughs> I don't know how to place you guys, so I'm able to do the stuff that I need to. Wind today, yes, it's not raining, but the wind, God, the wind is ridiculous. So, I'm gonna just take out my jacket. Fully on the right train. The train is quite empty, but there was a guy there previously. I don't know where he went. We are in Bruges, guys. Um, wait, I think the light is blinding me. Okay, I think this is better. We are in Bruges. Listen, I had to switch one train because the train that I initially entered. The one that you guys saw me um i don't know what happened i think it just didn't go to bruges anymore so or it didn't even go anywhere anymore to be honest so i had to switch but i'm here i got here fairly on time because it is so it was even less than an hour i'll say because i think i left the hotel at past 11. or was it past 10. i think it was past 10. I think it was past 10 actually i left the hotel at past 10 and it is almost 1 p.m so it, it's really not that it's like an hour or something basically but anyway we're here and i'm at the train station the bruce central train station and i just caught they didn't have both i almost lost my mind because i thought maybe they didn't have both 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 and both both bolt and uber but they have uber so I just ordered my Uber. It is five minutes away. I'm hungry, but I want to go to the canal first, like the canal central place. I think that's the first place that I want to, I want us to see. I want us to, you and I, I mean. <laughs> I want you and I to go to the canal first, ride a boat if they're open, because I know it's Sunday and most places aren't really open like that. So see if we can ride a boat uh, because the sun is shining, thankfully. Everything just seems nice and smooth, but it's cold. But yeah, um, I'm also trying to vlog and make a TikTok. So if you're not following me on TikTok, like I already said you guys in one of my vlogs, like I want to get serious with TikTok. So if you're not following me on TikTok, girl, follow me on TikTok. The content I want to be different. It's going to be obviously the same location, but the the videos have to be different, obviously. But anyway, I'm going to wait for my, bowl, my uh, Uber. It is four minutes away then we can be on our way to the canal i should never sing again actually this is me walking around i have a whole tripod in my hand and i just saw the first i don't know if i vlogged that but i, I recorded it for for tiktok but i'm going to the next canal just to look at it the first one really didn't have anything i think it's because it's sunday it's quite quiet but it was cute to look at anyway um so yeah this is behind the scenes <laughs> of like oh traveling alone and taking your own pictures and all that kind of stuff <sighs> my monthly started last night which honestly wasn't expecting it so i'm surprised that it's not put me in a bad mood not in bad mood but you know how it can be but i'm so glad it hasn't put me in that mood 
so yeah I feel like I'm also hungry the waffle I didn't even eat so much of it just little there was no need for me to buy two but I did but anyway it is so cold so I'm trying to get into one of those but I don't know where the starting point is or the start point is and I also don't know where to get a ticket but this is how this area looks so nice it's so small and cozy I'm trying to ask someone let me go the other way so you guys can see I'm trying to ask someone where I can find the ticket where I can get the ticket yeah I don't know let's just go this is the line to get a ticket over there and then wood board the boat there and then I guess he's going to like take us on a ride for I don't know how many minutes so I'm guessing 30 minutes but yeah we're about to do this we are, we are about to get on that boat once they finish uploading anyway but yeah I just got my ticket it was 12 euros oh this is upside down so it's not expensive at all we're about to go still loading though I think no. we're completed already My hair is a mess. But I can't stop talking sweet all by myself. Put your arms around me, put your faith in me, put your love on me. Clock and rewind, go back to that moment in time When you say you want me for life, was it all a lie? I gave my all to This is how the restaurant is Cute So I'm in the restaurant and I'm about to eat something I just placed my order for pasta, some spaghetti, scampi I think And then also I got tonic gin tonic I want something strong and then after this I don't think I'm going to do anything else oh my god look at this so, oh I don't know if I'm so good but anyway um, I don't think I'm going to do anything else after this I think I'm just going to go back to Brussels because I am ready to go back I couldn't get any good pictures today you guys like of myself obviously I got videos and stuff but pictures of myself today I was just really struggling so when I get back to the hotel I'll take more pictures I posted one picture on Instagram today so if you're not following me on Instagram go ahead and follow me I posted one picture but yeah, when I get back to the hotel, I'll try and see if I can take more pictures, like touch my makeup and take more pictures. But yeah. I don't think I can finish all this food, but this is what I ordered. I'm a bit tipsy, you guys, but I am full. I wouldn't say I'm full, to be honest. I couldn't really eat the food. I'm trying to just skip this, like I feel like my cake is oily. I don't know why, but I couldn't eat the food like that, so I got it to go. I packed it here. For me. So, if I'm being honest with you guys, I don't know if when I get to the hotel I'm going to eat this because I don't know. For some reason, ever since I got to Belgium, I'm not really, really, really wanting to eat. Like I've just. I don't know. I don't know. Whenever I travel, I have this feeling of not really wanting to eat. I feel like the only place that I really eat is Istanbul. Every time I go to Istanbul, I eat a lot. And that's because 
I'm sure of the food. I know places to go where I can eat and be satisfied. I'm not just trying out different things. I'm not sure the alcohol. Do you get what I mean? But still, like the food is nice, right? But I'm not a cheese person, and it has a lot of cheese. In it. So cheese makes me nauseous. Yeah. So. And I, again, yeah, my eyes are dirty because I'm a little bit tipsy from the gin and tonic. I had another one, so I had two in total. This is, I guess, the center center. Do you guys see? So I'm gonna try to cut a taxi from here, and I'm gonna be on my way back to Brussels. These make me so happy. You all see these? They make me so happy. I'm in a train. Right now. <sighs> this has been one hell of a journey. But I'm glad. I'm really, really glad. Bye, Bruges. Until next time. Tell me why. Wait, why am I zooming in? Tell me why I get to Brussels and it's raining cats and dog. You guys, like my bag is wet. Look at this. My entire face was wet. My hair was wet. But I got in like a few minutes ago and the first thing I just did was go to the bathroom to like dry off my face and my hair because I told you guys that I want to take pictures. Like I'm determined to do it. Even with the way that rain destroyed me, I'm determined to take like one last picture before I go back to Budapest tomorrow. I just want a picture. Like I feel like I did it. I know the camera is nice, which is really weird, but there's no way else to put you guys right now. So bear with me. But yeah, I'm determined to take pictures, like one last picture before I go. So that's what I'm about to do. I dried my hair so it looks like puffy and everything because like I said it was raining. Now I'm just going to run the straightener like through it quickly. It's going to be a really casual picture. I just want something fun, something casual and something relaxed, you know, like chill. I'll probably use like one of the the stairs that they have in the hotel good morning beautiful people i don't even know why i'm this excited this morning because i'm going back to budapest <sighs> i already took my shower obviously i'm dressed um it should be about 10 in the morning my flight is at 3 p.m so i want to go and grab breakfast or brunch or just something I want to eat food like something okay I want to eat food food I have my suitcase there like where where is that yeah that's my suitcase packed and ready to go everything is ready I just want to get everything set or I just want to get everything set so that when I come back from getting food and like probably maybe doing a last tour but within the vicinity of the hotel anyway i'll just be i'll just call my uber and go straight listen to the airport let me complete that statement but also i look like a mad woman i swear i look terrible i mean i didn't think of my last day's outfit, let's start from there. And then also, my hair is a mess. I just need to get home and take this wig off because the wig is not wigging. Like, it is not wigging at all. Like, uh, I look a mess, but I'm at a um, breakfast, coffee, snack type place. It's really cute. Um, I got myself a hot chocolate. I got myself some pineapples because I need it. And then I also got myself this hot chicken wrap. 
I hope it's good. The guy said it's good. <laughs> the guy said it's good. So I hope it is good. But yeah. I don't know, I walked around a bit, like a little, because I'm close to the hotel, but obviously, I told you guys, the hotel is close to, it's at the center, so I walked a little, just checked out some stores. I was hoping, you know the perfume that I said I love so much? I don't know if I said that. I was hoping that it would magically be open. I was hoping that it would magically open, because I did see on their website that they are always open. This is huge. But they are not open. Mm -hmm. I'm currently at the airport, going through security. Now I'm just waiting for my flight. I think I am definitely too early, but it's good. I mean, because I didn't know how to navigate the oh the airport, so it's good that I came early. I rather like wait than actually be late. Okay. Oh, that rhymed. That kind of rhymed. But anyway, as usual, I'm just going through, walking around duty free, trying not, trying my best not to spend money because I already did a lot. This, so I'm going to just look around. Oh, I know. I'm just looking back at the footage I have to edit for you guys, and I'm like, it's gonna be a lot of work. But I love you, so I'm gonna do anything I have to do to make sure that you guys get the content that you deserve. Hey guys, I just realized that I didn't close out the vlog. I got home last yesterday and it was, I don't know, it was a bittersweet feeling I would say. You know when you get that post vacation kind of depression or whatever. Yeah, I kind of felt that when I got home. So I ate, took a shower, and then I just went straight to sleep. I woke up this morning, and I'm straight to work. So I'm just about to start editing this vlog right now. But then I realized that I didn't close it off. So I'm just here to close it off. So thank you guys so much for watching the vlog. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope I was able to at least you know bring you along with me to the experience or to have the experience or whatever but anyway follow me on instagram if you're not following me subscribe to the channel if you're not subscribed thank you guys so 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 much for watching this vlog and sticking with me and i will see you in my next vlog bye guys